Hello, I'm Dudley Thompson and welcome to WDT Media TV. We're back here at White Wing. With the work continues on the housing project here at an Olympic Way. Here in the community. And as you can see, five plane work. The lay the foundation to lay more pipes along the work site here in White Wing. As you can see. The pipeline work continues here in White Wing. And here now in the center of the property where the stormwater drain channel is now under construction and somebody is asking if the stormwater drain will be above ground they have to ask the contractors to find out exactly if it will be above ground or below the surface water pipe here in the community on site and for those who are asking about the storm water drain you are seeing here it's already underground but here will be the the, the level is the sidewalk we are seeing here it will be the sidewalk on the road level so the water will run through here and go into the storm water drain so the drain will not be placed here it's already placed on the underground so water will run if it rains water will run in this channel this will be at the road level and the sidewalk level this channel you're seeing here and then runs down here and then into the star water drain which will also be covered as well so as you can see you see it now but it will not be above ground it will be covered as soon as the work with you you know under the marl the asphalt it will be covered so it would not be above ground we showed it earlier it will run right there down to the back of the property runs along here down to the wall you're seeing there and through here and into the gully out into the gully as we showed you earlier Alcar construction and haulage that the contractors now in the work here at White Wing. We tried to test the pipes earlier. And a slight leak was detected. It was quickly corrected. A meeting was held earlier today with the White Wing commercial operators. And the topical and the agenda was about compensation for the persons who operate commercial entities at White Wing. The meeting was held between the NHT, that's the National Housing Trust, 
member of parliament and also the persons who operate commercially at White Wing. And according to the, the operators, they said they were told that NHD did not did not have in their budget or their budget funds to compensate the persons who operate commercially at White Wing. They say that was said at the meeting. But they are saying that they're going to meet with their board and see if that can be arranged to put in place funds to, to sort of compensate the persons who operate commercially here at White Wing. That was discussed today at the meeting with the members of the community who operate commercially and also members of the National Housing Trust and the Member of Parliament. And as we told you earlier, Black Beauty is the only resident still residing here at White Wing. As of to the NWC for repairing the leak that was here quite for quite a while. But underground leak and what is it running along Maho Drive? And as we showed you earlier, fresh water is literally going down the drain. The source of the leak here in Quarry, Quarry Park in Silver Gardens community. Come on, eh? Someone put a stick here to yes, stop the leak. Yes, stop the leak. So a part yes. leak partially rather. Yes. I see that you see that you can let it. See that? See that come up and it is wrong, yes, sir. The whole light that comes from the ground, yes, sir. You know that if it come out, you see, man. You see the water start. Run. But I don't know how that. How would that? Are you there? Are you really there? And let me say, respect for you. Are you to just sticking out with the water for you? Respect. Put that respect for that. You hear me, though? The effort of a child to start to minimize the flow of the water here in the community, a child, yes. baby. And look, find who's a big child. It continues here. And so the water is still running here along Quarry Park. We showed you this part before. Water Commission repaired one leak down White Wing. But this one here is still running the pathway here in the community. As you can see, it runs through here and go out onto Maho Drive. And out onto Maho Drive. We are back here at, at Hagley Park Road here in three miles to look at the, the work on the rails since we last showed you the work on the rails along Hagley Park Road in the vicinity of Coburn Garden School nothing much um, since you can see We're going to clear the entire rail stretch and just give you a, a, a view that, as you can see, here is clean, but no work. As you can see, no further work. Sidewalk, you can see the hole still there. Nothing further was done. So the rail is there.
let that rails in real time. And as we go across the Coburn Garden School and uh, the rail here by the post office. Just need to do the, the finishing touch. For the most part, the rail is, in, is installed. But just the minor finishing need to be done on the rail here. And we are still calling for the mud pumice green space to be under the bridge. I'm Dudley Thompson for Roots FM News and also WDT Media TV. And again, please like, share and subscribe. And thanks in advance and thanks for watching.